Alright, what is up guys? And of course always welcome back to Season 3 of, of course, our Road to Master Rank. Now we have 6 wins and uh, 6... Oh, really? And that's about to change, I'm sure, uh, once we kick this in. One, this in. Um, I actually don't have that many days left. And uh, <coughs> I need at least, like, I think, um, 7 more wins to get myself to Master Rank. So with that in mind, you know, that that is what we're gonna do. We go into... Um, get ourselves into the zone and really hope that pans out. Uh, it should go without notice that, uh, like I said, this team is not really, you know, possibly the best team. But at the same time, I'm, you know, I'm, I'm feeling confident. Alright, didn't get to change my music that much. Anyway, Sir Sef Sefi is the one we're fending off against. Let's check our opponents. Right? Ugh. Ugh. Like, Ragnar Salt just, you know, it, it gets you in that mood, isn't it? Though, Valp looks to be quite right here. Um, definitely push upon a lot of damage. Um, I don't feel confident with... Crustle here. Um, Crustle could... Crustle, Crustle could... <laughs> Crustle could be on the right lead, I guess, but... Basically, I feel Torkoal Valplum. Um, Torkoal Valplum might very well win this game once I deal with Rotom. And the way I deal with Rotom is actually, you know, right period. Um, So, that's what we're gonna do. Right period is kind of a right. Right, let's do it. Let's do this. Mm, I'm feeling it. I'm not in. No. Crazy nervous, but you know, nervous, absolutely. Let's see what my opponent decides to bring. Let's hope I don't drop my mic. There we go. <laughs> so, let's see. Our opponent is going to lead off with Rodem. So that makes sense. <clears throat> so, the way I see it, I have two potential options. Rodem's Thunderbolt should do alright. And... Um, I'm actually going to be a bit greedy here. I'm going to have Stealth Rocks. I could have the easy switch into um, Rhyperior, I guess, get something out of that with Willow Wisp and whatnot. Um, there is no way he wishing he is actually is Wisping me, so with that in mind, I'm actually going to switch out. I'm um, not going to Dynamax, I think. Let's see. Yep, there's a play. Thunderbolt makes sense. So, yeah, so he should follow this one up with Will-O-Wisp. And, um, I'll, I'll just go for Stone Edge, just get the damage, really. Right, switches out, that's cool. To... What was that? Ka Katapuldra? Alright. Stone Edge should do, like, a lot of damage. Oof. Yeah, yeah, it, it it very much did so. Yeah. <clears throat> right. You know, with that in mind, I'm actually gonna go for that max rockfall and get my get my Dynamax form. Um, there is one Pokemon I fear, <laughs> and for obvious reason, and that is the Dracovish. As it's going to absolute without speed, but as long as it's under sun, I'm feeling confident I can take a hit. A retaliate weakness policy and whatnot. Um, let's see, Dragon Dots. Yeah, that that is not gonna hurt. I'm sorry, buddy, but that is that is not the respond. You, you hate to see it. And it's life up too. That's mm, yeah. All right, so we gotta lease our special defense race going. So when Dracosol comes in, we're gonna go directly for the Earthquake, I think. At least, like that, we're gonna get more special defense race. But if, like I said, if we have a Dracovish, like, I can see Fish's Ren doing. Oh, we're good. We're good. We're, we're real good. Alright, Max Knuckle? Ah. Uh, not really, get the stab going. Um, close combat? Nasty plot, right, so... I could assume that this guy could be... Um, 
It's be fair to say this is Sash, right? So getting that special defense raise might not have been such a bad idea after all. Well, you know, we'll keep go for that. Um, this aura sphere is gonna sting, that's for sure. Right, Dynamax, of course. That was going to be a really strong Max Knuckle. I wonder, what's the mistakes in Special Defense Raise plus Sand. You know, I'm worried. Should I be? It's plus two. Don't like this. Oh, like a champ! <laughs> that, that's, that's the nope damage. That's the absolute nope damage. And you just activated my trap card, son. You are getting so dead. Alright, cool. Um, <laughs> you know, that said, um, you know, I'm gonna get out of my Dynamax form. And while I have two special defense races behind me, um, I don't have the sun with me, so I need to reactivate that. And uh, I don't think Rodem should win, though, against me. Wait, I didn't get out of special defense race? Ah, oh, strange. Guess you're only getting one? Huh. What's that? Well, never mind. At least I won Special Defense Raise and I have player list Sandstorm. Um, just gonna Stone Edge. And we'll see what he do. Shadow Ball. So, neutral hit. I don't believe that's gonna sting that much. No. Alright, that's... Oh, that's wrap. Jesus Christ. Don't underestimate Rhyperior. I clearly did. It 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 blew this game out of the park. Well done, Rhyperior. That was cool. That was interesting. Um, I do want to check the team if I am able to. Action battle, right? So we couldn't share the team. I don't believe. I don't understand why people aren't sharing. Like for me, I think that's super interesting just to see what people's idea of the game was. There's not a great ball here, so things gonna be a bit tougher, and we need six more wins to be able to get ourselves to master rank. All right? See, hit me up. Japanese play. I'm sure. Oh, yeah, this looks the part. Uh, but th this is one of those teams I don't like see. There's so many whoopsies. Actually, right here still looks alright, but I'm not a big fan of Jados. Um, I do want my Stealth Rocks up, that's for sure. Charizard looks kind of right. Kind of, kind of have a rough time versus Rotom. You don't see Tyranitar. Valplume could be good. Actually, Crustle looks to be like you know. Haven't they been for Mimikyu? I'll actually find out something really interesting. Um, I think we're gonna lead off with. Um, I think it's a Rotom is so good against me that it's worth considering bringing right here anyway. So we'll do Torkoal, Helalisk, and right here. I'll lead off with Helalisk as it is our safest lead. So there we go. Um, I absolutely have issues here. Ferrothorn is very tough. Jarados also is very tough on us. If we're forced to deal with it, it's going to be very tough. Actually, kind of naturally. So, with that in mind, my hope is to... Um, since I am Scarf Hillis, I'm able to outspeed it no matter what. If it decides to go for a potential setup. Th this is this is what we were looking for. This is not what he was looking for. Um, <coughs> Alright, that's good. Um, Ferrothorn should be a switching, if he has it. Um, we're just gonna Volt Switch. 
He was probably predicting Torkoal, so that's alright. Um, so switches into... Excadrill. Nasty man. And it's the Mold Breaker variant. And I really don't switch in well at, at all to this. No, sir, I don't. So bringing in Torkoal, getting the sun up, and uh, I assume he's scarfed. Rock Tomb, alright. So that worked out surprisingly nice. <laughs> I, I was thinking, like, how do I do now? But yeah, I, I lost the speed, so eject button, nice. <clears throat> I'm gonna get your wither ball coming, son. Let's see if he suspects that. He must have thinking, you know... He's dynamaxing, though, you know, he's, uh, he's an absolute mad lad. Uh, <laughs> naturally. So... <clears throat> I get my... Earthquake is going to absolutely kill us, but the Weather Ball should do a fair chunk, I think. He's seen a complete team. No, he's not seen right here yet. So, right, Weather Ball does. Oh, but that nice. That is... You know, that's the damage you want to see. So, you know, I'm good. I'm good. Alright. Earthquake is going to give him a special defense race. And the way I see it, like, we're absolutely gonna lose. But I, I have an intention of losing with style. As I need to Dynamax directly. And, um... I guess I'm doing the Max Knuckle right. The sun is still up, so that's alright. I could have gone for... Um, max Rockfall, but I don't think that is in itself is gonna matter all that much. As there is really no way of me of stopping Yaros at all, so he's just gonna eat me alive. But the positive part about that is, um, you know what, we get a weakness policy activated here, it's gonna be awesome. <coughs> but yeah, Exodil really strains this team quite a lot, actually. Did not expect it to be so tough on us, but it is naturally. And uh, it's alright, it's tough, but it's alright. Yeah, close to half there. I hate to see it. And witness policy and superpower and basically like if he plays his cards right um, he should think about the sun, how much damage that could reduce his waterfall. Um, if he has power whip that's not gonna matter. But the way I see it, it depending on his last Pokemon, if that's Ferrothorn, then we're good. If it's anything else, we're screwed. And we could very well be screwed already. Because I lost Hillelisk. That Weather Ball did a lot of damage, but definitely not enough. 80% was nice. I was, did not expect that. I actually didn't. 80% is great damage. Had I been Life Orb, they wouldn't kill. That, was, that would have been insane. Right, switches in, Jarados. So like I said, I do fear this situation because I'm pretty sure Waterfall could KO us. It's still four times effective and that's... Oh, that is as awful as it gets. <sighs> it has, and if it has the Power Whip, it's, it's not gonna matter. I'm just gonna hope that he misses. And that's really all I have. Bounce. You know what? That is actually fine. I still got one turn of this. Do I sound really greedy if I said it, that that was... Did not expect that? 
He didn't get me paralyzed. This is gonna knock him out. What is his last Pokemon? Is it Veraphon? Please be? No, I, I am already feeling really defeated. I'm killing the sun myself. Just to reactivate it once I feel ready. But yeah, no more of my Dynamax form. So it comes down to his very last Pokemon. And that is... It is Rotom. It is Rotom. This is... This is looking great. I forgot you existed. Will-O-Wisp maybe? Overheat? Dark Pulse or Flinches? But I still got my special defense going, come on! And connect! Oh, that's... Oh shit, that is... We, we did it, boys. Mm. Right period, just... From clarity to clarity. Uh, oh, that's wonderful. Who the hell expected that? <laughs> ah, this is one of those, you know, you get the win, you're like, yeah, I'm not sure I deserve that. But, you know, I'll take it. Alright. <laughs> So I hope you guys enjoyed that. <laughs> I sure as hell didn't. Or did, I mean. Or didn't. <laughs> but yeah, that's gonna be our first video. And uh, we are now 8. Oh! I never thought I'd see the day. I'll be honest and say that. But yeah, <laughs> join us next time. Or tomorrow for the other two battles. We'll see how this goes. Thanks for watching and take care.